Hello everyone, and welcome to the magical adventure of Grot and Sleety. I'm Sleety as per usual, and in today's episode I would like to talk some about enchanting, you could say. Yeah, I guess enchanting and provisions. But especially enchanting. As you might have noticed, the... Well, let's see, what are they called? Enchanting... The aspect runes are a bit hard to find. They don't seem to be well dropped or deconstructed that often. However, I found a way that you can quite reliably get them actually. And it's through going and it's by going through lower level dungeons like this one, from Galgrotto, and finding heavy sacks. There. Oh well, let's see if we can find the uh, one more. I've done this a couple... Oh, there's one. I've uh, noticed when I've uh, done the lower level rounds that... Well, since... First of all... Since you're over leveled, the uh, loot that you get is much, much less than uh, if you would have been at an appropriate level. You actually don't get any loot from normal drops that are under your level, it seems. But you get crafting materials. And... What? What was I talking about? Of course. And as you saw there, these crafting sacks seem to yield a good, good resource. Oh, shut up! Good resource... of... Uh, runes and... well, more general stuff stuff for crafting like the gems or the uh, whatever they are called that are used to make for different styles. You get a good, good uh, quantity of those here. However, I I don't think there's that much in the chests actually. But, well, I can always get stuff that I can deconstruct so I open them anyway. It gives some experience as well. And oh look, a rune. Can always deconstruct that and hope to get shut up and hope to get some car. There, put more style. And let's see what we get here. Uh, my group actually left this dungeon up where they cleared it, and since we were all over level, they completely ignored all the, all the heavy sacks. I didn't, of course, but I missed some along the way. Which I'm not now trying to find. In the previous dungeon I was in, I got like, what can it be? Six ta and uh, about two of the green one. And there was probably lots of backsmith as well. Right now I'm just doing some cleaning duty, you could say, and I've still gotten some. Anything over here? No. But, yeah. If you ever want some uh, enchanting materials, take a look when you go through these dungeons. You might find a lot of useful resources, especially for enchanting. And if you want stuff that you can use to, uh, what's it called, research. I mean, the chests are guaranteed to contain a green, it seems. So it's basically free stuff. Just a bit of time. <laughs> There's plenty to go around, for sure. And, well... Even in a low level dungeon, you can apparently get soul gems. So this place is like a treasure vault. Now, I'm not too sure if there are some dungeons that contain more heavy sacks than others. That's something I have to research, and if such a thing exists, then I'm going to be so happy. Well, the thing you have to worry about though is, well, part one, 
make sure you get the loot before your teammate steals all of it. And second of all, don't steal everything for your team so that they become pissed. The best thing best thing you can do is well split up the loot evenly between you or something. That's something you have to solve on your own. Or just do as it happened with this group. While no one's watching, steal it all. If they don't know about it, they don't miss it. There doesn't seem to be that many bags around here though. It might be that the bags are more related to, uh, well, are areas with humanoid mobs you could say. Because likewise there aren't that many backpacks, barrels or that sort of thing around here as well. Chests seem to come in plenty though. So, let's see here. It was Fungal Grotto for this one. What the hell was that one named before? Spindle Clutch. Yeah, that's right. It was that one. I think the best one might possibly be Banished Cells, since it has the most humanoids or, well, undead, but it's kind of the same. I mean, they were humanoids once, right? Seems logical. Mm. Now we're closing in on the end, and for all this part, I've always seen chests. I mean, I get stuff. Nothing around here that I see. Hello? Well, I got some out of it at least. Just don't give up yet, because... Well, do you see? So yeah, compared to going out in the wild and searching for rooms, I definitely, I would definitely recommend this. Another soul game. Ram. We seem to be done here, so I'll guess I'll bid you farewell, people. Happy farming. See ya.